Hi, I'm Metal Tim from Brave Words, and I'm hanging out with Malaya Rage singer Paul Souza. How are you? Talking so about Idle Hands, their brand new record. Actually, I'm here to interview the legendary Metal Tim. <laughs> Let's talk about you filling the mighty shoes of Mike Monroe and owning it, putting your personality into Malaya Rage. You're a fucking athletic guy, and I was thinking of this question of like athletic rock. I couldn't help but think of Raven. Ah, right. Yeah. But you, you, you knew you had to own it. Uh, yeah, absolutely. Mike is amazing and a, and a good friend, as you know. Um, Mike has this kind of barrel-chested bravado, and I. I'm not Mike. <laughs> um, my, I, call, I always call my style more slash and burn. Right. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, you know, I had some reservations when I first joined the band uh, for that reason. You know, anytime you replace, a, you know, a great front man, a great singer, it, it's, it's daunting. And, uh, you know, I had reservations about it, but... Um, you know, Tony and I talked a lot, and I listened to the music, and I, I love the stuff that he writes. And uh, so when he sent me, he sent me a CD, and it sat on my dining room table for, uh, like, months. Right. And I was just, I, I wasn't doing anything, I wasn't gigging, I wasn't playing, you know, I didn't have any projects going. So I picked it up, and I threw it in, and I was like, wow, this is really good. And, you know, that was the, uh, that became the uh, Barely Human album. Right. And uh, so I came up with some lyric ideas and said, hey, I've got some ideas, and he brought me down to the studio, we went in and do it, and we were working with uh, Joe Moody at the time, who has since passed, and uh, Joe was like, dude, you gotta do this, you know, this is, you, know, you can do this. And so, you know, with their vote of confidence, uh, it, it gave me the confidence to kind of stretch myself a bit, and, uh, you know, it's, it's been amazing. But you've been kind of an alien, like you were, at the time, you were kind of an alien coming from this different musical world. Yeah. You know, my, my, I have a fairly eclectic background when it comes to music, and um, I just, uh, I, I, I love everything as long as it's good. <laughs> and, uh, you know, everything from R&B to alternative to Motown to, and of course, you know, the heavy stuff. And, uh, and I think it's, it's kind of cool because you can draw from a lot of that stuff, even when you're doing a, a certain genre. You can kind of steal ideas here and there from that and kind of maybe puts a little bit of a different twist on it. I think on the uh, Idle Hands record, I think these are the best choruses I've ever written. And, uh, you know, I get my sense of, of melody in the choruses from that old R&B stuff and, uh, you know, the Motown stuff that I used to right. listen to growing up. 